there is an absence of clarity at that top strategic planning level within the company with respect to clarity of product, clarity of customer, clarity of competitive differentiation, it will translate into confusion at the selling coalface. And if salespeople are confused, their potential buyers will be confused. And if those buyers, those potential buyers are confused, there is less likelihood of them buying. How to reduce uh, such confusion at the sales interface? Um, back to fundamentals of discipline and detail. Um, get organized around goals, around metrics, and have mechanisms for tracking progress against those, those goals, uh, as it were. And the prime mechanism for such tracking, I recommend to be the, uh, the weekly or the monthly sales meeting. And that's where you can differentiate whether you're being effective versus busy in the market. When I talk about uh, focus and clarity and consistency, particularly in terms of staying on message, um, I believe that the most difficult one at all, of all is to maintain consistency. And oddly enough, that particularly applies to organizations or individuals who do understand their value and who believe in it um, and who are good talkers. But the issue that they face is they can sometimes talk for too long. And so if they meet a similar set of requirements between customer A and customer B, then the response from them should be similar. Too often it is the case, particularly with enthusiastic entrepreneurs and owner managers who can talk all day uh, and passionately about their product or service, that those answers will be different and fundamentally they shouldn't be. So the, 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 the trick is to stay on message and be consistent in terms of that sales message.